is no secret that this opening day will be different as some fans return to Great American Ballpark during the COVID-19 pandemic. WCPO sports reporter Mike Dyer explains the changes in store at the ballpark this season. Longtime Red season ticket holder Casey Green can't wait until opening day. It's going to be like heaven. I think we're going to see a, a lot of people at the ballpark more excited and more pumped up than ever. It's going to be less going to be less people that are busy uh, socializing and 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 more into the game. With Great American Ballpark capacity set at 30 percent, there will be roughly 12,000 fans. However, Reds president and chief operating officer Phil Castellini still expects plenty of noise. It's not going to feel like the 45,000 opening day normally feels like, but I, I, I can promise you having sat through all of the, the, the 30 games last year, uh, um, and if not for our grounds crew doing such a great job of making noise, um, so that, that 12,000 fans in Great American is going to sound like a roar. Uh, and certainly to our players, and I know they're looking forward to that energy. That energy will accompany new health and safety measures across the ballpark. It will have plenty of signs emphasizing masks, social distancing, and hand washing. You're going to see our people reminding you of all the safety protocols. And we're also trying to do as touchless as possible. So converting to all digital tickets, uh, cashless, you won't see hawkers in the stands. When you come into the building, you'll see us... Uh, you know, the stickers on the ground like you see in other points of retail today. Stadium seats are assigned in pods of two, four, or six to allow for social distancing. That impacted season ticket holders whose seats often had to be relocated. I was frankly thrilled that, that the seat location was still so darn good. I was worried that that I'd get moved into, a, you know, a completely different section. And, and uh, uh, so... No complaints at all. I, I don't know how they could have been more reasonable about giving us options. Green is thrilled about returning. He has already envisioned what he might order while at the game. I'm going to have to have at least one beer just to, to really enjoy the experience. And, of course, got to have a dog or two on top of it. Mike Dyer, WCPO 9 Sports.